this is Christian from Velamet. Today's video is from the International Trade Fair for Automation in Production and Assembly, the MoTeC Fair in Stuttgart. And I'm here at the booth uh, of Rose and Krieger, together with Florian Blab and Urban Daub from the Fraunhofer Institute in Stuttgart. Um, as you can see, there's a special measuring setup, laboratory configuration for um, ergonomics or biomechanical measurements in um, ergonomics. And this uh, specific setup has been designed together with uh, the Fraunhofer Institute and Rosa and Krieger. And maybe Florian, you can give, and give us some insights into that special configuration and what made you designing that special biomechanical lab setup. Yeah, um, formerly our department was mainly interested in uh, prosthetics, orthotics and um, biomechanics in, in general. Um, designing medical um, devices. Um, our institute in Stuttgart um, is mainly interested in uh, production engineering and automation, so uh, ergonomics and um, analysis of um, movements at, at work um, become more and more important for us. Um, so we had a problem with our old lab that we cannot um, yeah, set up the, the right um, measurement um, designs for our um, for our for our needs, and um, due to that um, we uh, looked for a more general um, possibility to do a, a very flexible arrangement of force plates, of um, cameras, of integration on, of workstations within our biomechanical measurements. Okay, Urban, in that particular setup there are different main components that are integrated. Could you explain what we have here? Yeah, we have uh, th three systems combined. Uh, at first we have this uh, motion capture system by Qualysis. Uh, second is the modular system itself. And the third part are the uh, force plates. As you can see, they're a little bit lighter on the ground. And what you see here is our worker working at this um, special work station. In the background you see on the screen how he's moving around. And together, combined um, with the motion capture system and the forces uh, by the force pl uh, plates, the, the forces inside the body, we can uh, calculate them. Um, here also you can see the, uh, the modular system is a little bit higher than the normal ground. So all the uh, cables that we need for our force plates, for example, they are beyond. So nobody could step on them, they are, they are not on the way and um, it's a very safe place. You can put it together everywhere, we can do any um, workplaces in here, we can um, uh, build them up or we can put them right into, uh, in, into the company and uh, do our measurements there. Okay, and then uh, Florian, I see that specific uh, force plate mounting here. Mm. What is so special about that force plate mounting? It's to totally modular, isn't it? Yeah, you're right. Um, the special thing is more or less the combination of the aluminium profile um, with these uh, adapter plates um, that are mounted on the aluminium profile. Um, the whole system is independent from the kind of force plate um, or from the force plate manufacturer because it is um, working with a um, steel plate that is mounted on the bottom of the force plate and that um, acts with the um, with the adapter plates on the on the aluminium profile um, that allows us to um, use it in such a working environment um, but furthermore you can also use um, the same system for stairs and ramps in, in gate analysis because you can put your force plate as a, as a step of your of your stair or you can directly um, put your plate in the in the ramp um, that is built up aus, out of the um, aluminium profile system of Rosen Krieger. Mm -hmm. So having worked in a biomechanical uh, laboratory myself, I know that crosstalk between force plates and the surrounding floor is a, is a big issue. Is a big issue. Um, how did you solve that problem here? Yeah, we had some, some pilot studies and um, tested some different designs of these um, adapter plates and um, 
do also a special um, a special insert in the corners of the surrounding um, wooden plates. So um, with these um, inserts, um, we could um, reduce or eliminate the the crosstalk uh, very very good, and we're very um, very happy with this solution.